Welcome ladies and gentlemen to Let's Play Academia, my name is Weasel and today we're going to check out the school simulator, uh, very fitting with, you know, the start of the school. This is very prison architect-esque, not only from the look, but also from the interface and from what I've seen in those five minutes I figured and uh, played around with the game a little bit. Other than that, I'm pretty clueless, so forgive me if, you know, this is, I'm stumbling along, I will try my best. We're going to be starting a new game, uh in Academia by making our own school. Um, first, we're gonna have to have a name for that. What about Weasel High? I like that, given that it's a high school. And our motto is, if your parents are rich, you'll get good grades. All right, that, that sounds good. Primary color, yellow, nah, let's go with orange and something that really looks awful, just kidding. Uh, let's go orange, orange, that's good. You can even select your own icons. Why, why, why a lantern? Mountain, mu music note sounds nice. I do like a snake though. How about we just make it snakes? That's a badger, that's not a badger. That That is anything but a badger. Perfect, four snakes, that's good enough. Let's go ahead and start the school year. So as you can see, this is very prison architect-esque in terms of style and controls, as I mentioned before. Uh, we have our to-do open, so we're gonna have to build a freshman classroom. That's the first thing we're gonna have to do. And, you know, if you played prison architect, you'll you'll get an idea of what you kind of have to do and how to build it, but yeah, it, it doesn't have a tutorial from what I can tell other than this to do. So we're gonna build some basic education, we're gonna build that freshman classroom. I'm gonna make this one a little bit bigger than I did the last time. It looks, it looks like a good time. And we're gonna designate a zone to this. Uh, where is it? Classroom. Class, there you go. Poop. Okay, cool. We have a freshman classroom now. The next thing, if you hover over it, you see what you need. A chalkboard, a student chair, office table, and a chair. All right, so office table for the teacher. That sounds good. You rotate with R. Uh, sure, I'll just have that here or so. I guess that wouldn't make more sense to have it sideways in the... Ah, screw it. It's fine. We're going to make it wide. Just jam that somewhere over here. I actually don't want that, so I'm right-clicking it. Uh, student chairs. We're gonna need like 10 of those. It's rather crazy. So one, two, three. Let's do like... I wonder if they can reach those back there, or if that might be too tight. Ha! Huh, we'll never know. Excellent question. I don't know if they can walk over other uh, uh, chairs. You know, I'll, I'll just make the room bigger. That's not a problem at all. If you want to do that, you just pull your concrete wall here. And if you want to remove something, you just pull up demolish. Just gonna take him a while to do that. Not a problem at all. We have still plenty to do to get that classroom going. We're gonna need a door. I guess that's under all. Frig of I know. Office, classroom. Why would there not be doors? This is very specific. Oh, it's under build. My bad. As I said, I don't know my games. Okay, um, door entry over here. I think this is fitting. And, yeah, those workers are kind of stuck. Who's paying these guys, by the way? Because I'm definitely not paying them. All right. Time to edit that zone. Uh, where would I do that? It says failed chair, right? The chair for the guy that has it. That teaches there. That's what I meant. Excellent. So, now we made this room a little bit bigger. They can definitely reach those uh, chairs now. And we have a chalkboard. Now, we need to hire a teacher once we've done this. I think, yep, we're done. This room is done. Beautiful. Doesn't need anything else. Doesn't need a hallway or anything. We were starting slow. All right, assign a teacher to the freshman's course. We're gonna go to staff and get a teacher. Yay! Good question. Who are we gonna get? Ah, uh, the question. I think these mean this is a doctorate, masters, bachelor. All right, we can only afford a bachelor. What about Barrett Pulling? Sure-ish. Why not? Okay. How much are you? Three thirteen a day. That's not bad. I should become a teacher. Did we hire him already? No, no, we have to place him. All right, cool. So we have one teacher who's hired. Ah, there's nothing I'm gonna do with him yet. Transferee. Oh, transferee admission. I have no idea. I'm not. I have never ran it. I have never ran a school. All right, build a kitchen, build a cafeteria, and hire a cook. Okay, a kitchen. What does need to go into the kitchen? That's the question. Kitchen sink, a refrigerator, and a stove. Yeah, I, I can do that. Not a problem. Another concrete wall. Let's get a hallway that's like three wide, four wide. Let's do three wide. We'll we'll see how that works out for us. Okay, the kitchen. It's gonna be. I'm gonna say roughly this size. And then we want to have a cafeteria. We're gonna make that one definitely a chunk bigger, so we can feed all the hungry children. 
And we're gonna need doors. Uh, I guess staff door for staff areas only. I, I assume the kitchen is a staff area area only. So we will put that in. Another one here. And the regular door goes there. You think you would want a bigger one. Anyway, zones. Let's go ahead and put the cafeteria in, giving us an idea what we need to do. And kitchen. Where would that be? A little hard to see. There you go, kitchen. Let's uh, finish up the kitchen by put putting up a kitchen sink in there. I don't think we need to hook up water. I have not seen anything like that. Refrigerator. Ooh, good question. Well, over here, that way it can be reached. You see these like black circles? I'm fairly certain those are the spaces that need to be free so they can access it. Let's put like two stoves here. How, how are we doing on money? 39,000, we still got plenty of room left. Cafeteria, yay. Okay, table and then benches. Wouldn't like one be enough? I, I feel like one would be enough. And canteen bench, sure. It has to do. <laughs> At this point, it has to do. So we have this counter and a plate counter. Doesn't look like anyone needs to be behind it, but I'll still put it in the middle of the room just to be on the safe side. And the plate counter. There you go. There they can. Oh, dirty dishes go here first. You know what? That's fine. They'll figure it out. What about floors, by the way? Because we're still. There's trees or bushes inside that room. Concrete tiles. Mmm, let's do, well, first kitchen zone. This is uh, kitchen zone tiles. And then, of course, concrete tiles for the uh, classroom. Nothing too fancy. A male statue. What about a female statue? Do we have those? Yes, we have those too, and a fountain. I guess this is good enough. So now that we build the kitchen cafeteria, we're probably gonna have to hire a cook. Single cook will do, 600, yeah, sure. And. Do we need a janitor? Nah. What? You want three cooks? Okay, I hired three cooks. That's... <laughs> that's a lot. Okay, you can now start the school! Yay! I don't know... Oh, there. Okay, let's see what they think about this. Most likely not too not, uh, much. Okay, workers are coming in from the side. Okay, nothing on it to do right now, but here. There's available grants you can get. School health. Students and staff will inevitably get sick. Build a clinic so they have somewhere to go when they have the flu. Um, gives 2,000 advance, build a clinic and hire two nurses. You know what, for now, let's not. School expansion, 50. Increase it to 50. Well, my biggest question is when are we gonna have our first uh, people coming in? That would be my big question. Transfer admissions. I guess you can enable how many you will take. Not sure, oh, you're starting the day with a breakfast, is that what you're doing? Look at our kids. Freshman, classroom one, hanging out. How many do we have? That's more than 10 people. We have more than 10 chairs, so that's good. Do we have like an information? Yeah, 14 freshmen. That makes sense given that we have 14 chairs. So I guess they automatically fill up. That would be my best bet. And we're making money. Freshmen, we get, yep, we get 200 per or 100 per. I think it's 100 per because we have 14. That looks good. All right, where's the teacher though? Teacher. Okay, teacher's coming in. He starts teaching. And you just have... What are you doing? Doesn't that say anything? Motivation, bladder. Oh yeah, toilets. Right. Right. We don't have such a thing yet. We should probably build a toilet. Um, Doesn't seem like I can build... Yeah, it's gonna be a unisex one. That's fine. Okay. No one needs to be something smaller. So I'll build it over here. This looks like a good size toilet. Um, bathroom tiles down. While while they're doing the teaching thing. He's teaching. Attending class. Wonderful. I need to worry about nothing. I mean, at least when it comes to teaching. Okay, door. Oops. Let's put that where it belongs. A toilet cubicle. Yay! Um, how does that get put on the wall? I think like this. Yeah, it looks good. Four, I think, should do, and then we can add some urinals. Two of them. A sink. So they wash their hands. Ah, they never wash their hands. We already know they won't. They're the worst. Why don't you wash your hands? Okay. So, that's... I figure that's enough. That's a pretty big bathroom. Should, should take care of 14 people. Your school is dirty. Your students might get sick. Well, then let's hire a janitor. We have a little bit of extra money, I guess. And uh, 600 cleans your school. Yay. 
So having a hallway, <clears throat> excuse me, wouldn't be a bad idea. So let's let's do that. Let's put concrete down all the way around here. It's gonna make this go along this way. Yeah, let's 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 spend some extra money here. We we can't afford it. Not a problem. Okay, concrete walls. We're just pre-building the hallway as it is right now. Okay, it's a little bit awkward, but it'll do. It'll do. And of course, we're gonna need an entrance door. I would like to see one at the front here. Needs more stuff on the floor. Okay, that's garbage. How about we erase some of that zone? Zone edit. The garbage zone. We're gonna make a new one. Where is it? Garbage. Sure, this is big enough, I think. What are you complaining about? You need to use the toilet? We have a toilet, a perfectly fine toilet. Sink, urinal. Did they all just pee on the floor? Oh my god, they peed all over the floor. Oh my god. Are you for Rizzity Real? Uh, now they want to wash their hands, which they also can do. So what's what's the matter? Your students might get sick. Well, that's, that's a problem. Going to urinate. Okay, you're urinating outside in the bushes. That is certainly interesting. Toilet training. Okay, you can't have your students and stuff just peeing everywhere. Build a male and female toilet. How do I do that? Apply. Okay. So I figure I need two different ones. I haven't seen where I set that up though. I guess I have to build two toilets of sorts. Okay, four toilets and of course, I guess two sinks should do the trick, I feel. Let's do let's do free. I feel fancy today. Let's hire let's hire a uh, another janitor just to help clean up this place. It's really gross. Oh boy. At least stuff is getting cooked so they're not hungry. They're all upset. Why are you upset? You have no fun. I have no fun. I mean, I do have fun seeing you suffer, but other than that, I have no fun. <laughs> Oh, did I remove the toilet zone from here and that's why they're peeing everywhere? I forgot to designate this as a toilet. My bad. Okay, that's better. Yay, everyone's using the toilet. I did build two toilets, so my question is, why is this not working out? I guess we're going to figure out the secret of the male and female toilet in the future. I, I personally think this is, having two toilets like this is perfectly fine. God, there's pee everywhere. Where, where are the janitors when you need them? Ah, well. We're slowly but steadily making some sort of progress. All right, he's, he's cleaning it up, but it doesn't look like he's throwing it out. He's just walking around, picking up something and dropping it again. Do I need like a trash thing? Janitor's room. Trash can. Sure, just a trash can. How about we put the trash can inside this room? Also the toilet. I think that's where you should put trash cans. We should have some. Same with the classroom. I see no reason not to have trash cans everywhere. Well, that's certainly interesting. Carrying trash to trash can. Isn't this a trash can? I mean, don't, don't, don't get me wrong. This is, this is a very legit tra trash can. Well, that concludes the first day. <laughs> I have two workers that are sleeping on the floor. They apparently were not able to put anything down. I have absolutely no reason why. The trash can should have worked. It's like, oh yeah. <sighs> oh well. Trash dumpster. Oh, wait a second. Oh, let's dismantle that. Could it be that it was that problem that the trash dumpster wasn't on the garbage? Yeah, it has to be in the garbage zone. My bad. Okay, I just had to load up the game again because there doesn't seem to be a way to build your own trash dumpster. Maybe there's somewhere, but I haven't found it in any of the menus. So, ugh, gotta be careful. Oh, there it is. It's, it's hiding under all. It doesn't have its own category. Well, the more you know, that means now we can put one there and dismantle that. Again, this is early access, so it's a little bit rough around the edges. But other than that, I'm really enjoying this so far. I like how much I can plan this out. All right, there you go. Let's build that again. Hope these guys wake up soon. You know what? Sleeping on a job, you're fired. Even though it costs 600 to hire a new one. I'm willing to do that. Now you do your thing. Uh, I would love to increase the size. Maybe there's something to build under uh, objects all that designates it as a male versus female uh, bathroom, but so far I'm not seeing anything that does that. Edit toilet. Oh, there you go. You have to edit that. Gender, female. Edit toilet. Oh, actually, 
edit toilet. This one is going to be female and this is going to be male. All right, perfect. So you have to go under zone edit to change the individual zones. Edit classroom. You can give it different names and what class here they are. Under the kitchen, hmm, nothing, nothing. Okay. We learned a thing. That makes me happy. Okay, zone edit delivery zone. I would like to remove some of that. Yeah, I'll just build my own one. And let's... Oh, I'm gonna have to demolish those tiles. Good enough. And I'd love to have some planters near the entrance. I will do that eventually, but I think the janitors are slowly cleaning up. They're very, very slow. Carrying one trash at a time. Let's hire another one. Free, free janitors, free cooks. For 14 kids. Man, talk, talk about a, a great education. Great, the best education you've ever seen. All right, cleanliness is next to a godliness. Is that so? What do we have to do for that? We have to build a janitor room and hire four janitors. Okay, sure, I'll hire another one. Sweet. That's done, and we need a janitor room. I guess I can squeeze one in here. What does a janitor room have? Just a kitchen sink and a table, I guess, to fix up some stuff. So here you go. An elongated... Sta janitor room. Let's put a staff door in so don't, no stupid kids walk in. Some concrete tiles. And a table. Oh, just plain old boring table like that. Okay. Kitchen sink. So they can wash their hands, I assume. And a chair. I, I don't know. I guess that's for the table. So I can put the chairs on there. How are my kiddos doing? Well, fun is pretty low. Who cares? PE, physical education. I want to pee. Well rested, happy, clean. Okay, it's clean. That's good. He wants to pee. He can do that. We have those rooms. What, what are you doing there, dude? Who are you teaching? You're not teaching anyone. You're not fooling me. All right, it's recess. And with that, we conclude the first episode of Academia. I hope I'm saying that right. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this school simulator. If you did, please leave a like. Let me know in the comments if you'd like to see more uh, and what you would like to see and what you like about the game. I'm really curious about your thoughts. Anyways, thanks so much for watching. I'm Weasel. I'm out and I hope to see you around. Bye-bye.